Hey guys, and welcome back to Pixelmon, and we have eradicated in our house. Uh, yeah, this is the... Yeah, I've been a while since I've played Pixelmon, so sorry if I'm a bit rusty. Yeah, let's get into this. Oh my god, look, we've got things coming in our house. We need to get rid of them. Like, seriously. we got to get rid of them now. Alright, actually, do we have any iron to make an iron pickaxe? That would be a good thing to have. Do we have any iron at all? We have nothing. We we are poor plebs. We are poor. Poor. We are coal. I suppose we have. Oh, we do have iron. Ah, that's one thing we got to do is create. Uh, we'll create a shovel as well. Uh, we do need to get some wood actually. So yeah, we're gonna get some of that soon. Oh, uh, what's my crafting? It's right there where I was. Like uh, the silly man I am. Okay, boom. Uh, oh, doing it. And yes, that's good. All right, we got all wiring tools now. Quick, and now we're gonna go out here. And we're gonna create a nice little apricot farm. I think down here will be nice. Just here somewhere. Not right next to the house, but not too far away, which would be nice. Uh, here we go, some apricots. I'm just gonna put that coal in a furnace, but uh, well. one, two, three, four. We need to find a yellow one. Two, three. I don't know if we got a yellow one when we can make some ultra balls. I'm all, I'm all up in those ultra balls. I love ultra balls. Always have. Ultra. -y. No yellow. So I guess the day's mission is for my mouse not to run out of battery. What the hell? Oh, there we go. What was going on? Ah, oh, down for I'm just gonna toggle this. Just gonna toggle that. Uh, I toggled it when I first come on. It just starts raining all the time in my world. Uh, just because it marks up the frame rate, and nobody wants to see all this rain all the time. You know what I mean? Uh, you guys might not be able to see this properly. Actually, I will brighten the video slightly so then you guys can. Isn't bright, bright, bright? Yeah. So hopefully you guys can see in the dark. Unfortunately, the dark is, you know, a problem. I could probably set time today, but to be honest, I don't know how to do that. I big noob. Oh, hello, hello there, my lovely. All right, Lady Bar, cool. Let's see how many magic cards about after I slaughtered the load. They're like. They don't even want to come around anymore. Come here, Ladybug. We're gonna. Oh my god, he flew away. He's like, nah, mate, I don't want to mess with you. You got them next level Pokemon. No, that was wrong. That was wrong. It's Pokemon. That's better. <coughs> Gotta say it right. Oh, there's Magic Art. They've started spawning again now. For some reason, last time I played this, I didn't see a single Pokemon in the whole episode, and I was just like, what? I don't know why I'm going over here. It's like I'm meant to be looking for some witch's hut. Could be dangerous. Like a geo dude just stood there. Witches, I swear they still spawn in their huts in Pixelmon. Because I was once playing Pixelmon, and all these witches just started spawning in their huts, and it was not a good time. We had problems, man. It's Clefairy. Got a bit of a lag spike there, probably because the chunks are loading in. Seriously. Ever since I've been playing this on uh, launcher, it does lag considerably. It's like, what? Let's grab a bit more of that coal. Just really leave it till I've got a, at least a uh, fortune one. Unfortunately, we don't have 1.8 chance on this, so it's not easy to get in chance. Or the ones you want anyway, like fortune and stuff like that. I believe fortune. What the gears? Hello. That's a part two. A lightning shard. That's part two. A uh, lightning stone. Lightning stone shard. Ooh, both cool. What we got? A fire stone. Okay, we've already got a fire stone. I think I believe you can uh, evolve a growlite into uh, a growlite evolution, which I cannot remember his name. Uh, I know the Pokemon, he's big, he looks like a dog, he looks awesome, 
but for the life of me, I cannot remember his name. Okay, there's a lot of gravel around here. Like, I don't, I mean, I mean, a redonkulous amount of gravel. was like, if we ever need flint, we just come here and just tear this mountain apart. So I, I could do with a mini map, I tell you that much. Maybe, maybe I'll restore a mini map mod later. Just because I, I do like mini maps, make they make move around much easier. But I could create a map because a map would be quite nice. Anyway, guys, yeah. So this series will be continuing. Don't worry uh, for a while. Yeah, I might have to jump back on Pixel Town soon just to have a little play around on there because I learned that you can actually play that for free now. Hey, Magic Carp, <coughs> which is quite nice. <coughs> but I think there are, <coughs> sorry, specific times where you have to pay for stuff. Oh my gosh, stop using tackle. Magic Carp's like going in. Now he's going in. Tail whip. I think that uh, defense has decreased. Uh, I think Oath Sludge does something as well. Okay, it didn't do anything. That's fair. Decrease those defences. I'm in the lead. Yeah, I'll win this. Yeah, get me some fish. Fish, 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 fish. Uh, it's a good thing because that's some food. I can get potatoes and stuff in this, and chicken, uh, leather, cow meat from other uh, cows. Also, I do want to grab. Oh, what? That is a small magic harp. It's got to go down. Sorry, I can't. I can't let that stuff stand, man. Too small. I got two raw fish from that magic heart. So from that big one, I got two. From that little tiny thing, I got two as well. Surprising. Yeah, today we're looking for a yellow thingamajig, but you're meant to be in forest to find uh, them. But I thought I'd come this way because I went in that upper forest last time and I didn't find one. So I was hoping that there was going to be a forest over here somewhere. I was also hoping that it wouldn't be. The terrain wouldn't be too much like this. Oh, here's a forest, so that's okay. Yeah, it's okay. It's only hung. It's only one hunger. I mean, one hunger, one heart. It's fine. Uh, come on. Oh, here we go. Boom. We got it. Okay. Is that a char? What the hell was that? Is that Charmander? Charizard? Oh my god, look at that Charizard. Random Charizard just standing there like, I'm a boss. I'm a boss. Level 47 Charizard. I'll pass. I'm trying to take on that guy. I'll let this little Machamp. Machamp. Uh, no, not Machamp. Uh, Machimp, I think it is. As well. You get some really cool things in here, I've got to admit. There's a Stalin. I was going to go up there and grab that electric stone thing, but I just can't bother in the end. Let's go grab this thing over here. We actually could do with more diamonds, so maybe we'll go a bit more mining soon. Go on a mining adventure. Maybe we'll go try and find some fossils as well. I think fossils spawn uh, from 50 down to a certain amount. So if it does, that's in gravel as well. If it does, uh, where's my... Yeah, it's got, I've got to be way lower than what I am now. But if, it, if, it, if you could do it on the mountains, these mountains would be like... Legends. I mean, seriously, you just, just just hammer through this stuff. So we we do need to make a mob grinder, a spell, or something, some some sort of XP income. Because, well, as you can clearly see, we're not gonna be able to keep this up all the time. Yeah, give me some fish, fish, fish. I'm gonna get back home. Gonna plant this up. Then that will be our our farm done. Our, ap our apricot farm for the moment. I don't really want to worry about other things. Apparently, uh, is it not a level ball. Yeah, a level ball helps you catch low level Pokemon. So maybe I'll get a few of them later. And is it there's another ball which helps you catch Pokemon over a certain amount of time? I'm finding them everywhere now. The yellow ones. Uh, uh, have a certain amount of times you've been in combat, and apparently, it, after 50 turns, it just captures any Pokemon or something like that. 
but yeah, if you can stay alive for 50 turns in combat, have a fun. Or is it 15? I'm not sure. It might be, it might be 15. I, I can't remember exactly. I'm getting myself lost here. I, I think it's off to the left, but I just want to pick up this Pokeball. Man, these, these frames are really starting to get on my nerves. I mean, seriously. I don't know what's wrong with Pixel Mon Lady. I don't know. Maybe you guys can tell me. You guys know why it's being a little bit jumpy. Do tell, do tell. Probably because my computer is smelly and it's just terrible. Alright. It, it doesn't normally do this if, I, if I'm not recording though, so... It's probably just my computer is being derp. Alright, I think I've gone the wrong way. Well, I had to go back over the mountains, I believe, so that's just... That's heading away from spawn. I don't think we were that far away from spawn, so... I think it was this way. Well, here's a forest. I know we were near a forest like this. So we were either over down here somewhere, or we were over there somewhere. And we're increasing our X. I don't know where the hell we were. <laughs> how how to get lost? How to get lost, craft? Uh, that's what this is. Uh, I might just have to grab some stuff, climb up, put my render distance up, and then just take a look around quick. Because I am a lost. Um, I'm actually, that's, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn my render distance down, just to see if I can improve the frames a little bit. There you go. To turn it down to 10. I normally play with it on like 12. I used to play with it on max, but I used to play uh, just the default. Well, I suppose this is cool because we're uh, <coughs> we're getting a lot of pokey loot, I suppose, and I do believe there are like pokey temples and stuff like that, which you can loot, but it's finding them. I, I believe I'm gonna get lost here. Yeah, I'm pretty much lost. I am so lost; it's ridiculous. <coughs> oh wow! What can you do? Grab some apricots. Uh, it doesn't really matter. We will. We can always. We, we'll. F I'll find home later. I'm not really worried. This is a good adventure. Let's see what is actually around us. Anyway, it seems like we got a pretty terrible place. Really, there's no poke centers around us. There's a lot of extreme hills. I mean, around our actual where our house is is pretty good. Somehow I've got made it to the ocean. Oh, it's not the ocean, it's just a big freaking lake. So we definitely know we're going the wrong freaking way. There's a cedar in there. God damn. You guys are my. Ah, oh, I've lost it, but it was in there somewhere. If you guys rewind it, pause it, zoom in, you might be able to see it. Yeah, I think uh, the chunks. I don't think how many chunks I'm loading makes a difference on my frames. I think it's just the uh, the entities loading in. Because I'm always at 30 until a certain point and the entities load in and it just starts getting a bit jumpy. So maybe I'll have to uh, transfer over to a new world just on Forge. And just put... Um, Pick someone on Forge. Something like that. I don't know. It depends if it gets really bad. It is it is getting bad to be honest. I'm getting really annoyed with it. Okay. Well, this is derpy. Hey you fight me. I didn't throw it far enough. I did throw it far enough. I'm basically a level sixteen magic cart. Yay! Oh, okay. Fight me, fail. <laughs> that big onyx there is like, hello. Uh, I think we'll do we'll just explore for the rest of the episode and then. Yeah, no, I'll work my way back uh, in my own time. Because to be honest, it doesn't really matter. Oh, 
Oh. Oh, a jungle biome. That's cool. I was going to go looking for one of these uh, sometime because of... Oh, look at that, a Venomoth. Well, be ma mostly because of all of the... Like, obviously, jungle temples, but I want some jungle saplings, too, so... Uh, to make a tree. So, I like, I like the trees. Maybe I'll make, like, a tree house or something. I made a pretty awesome tree house, uh... On one of my solo worlds when I was just playing Derpin around. Maybe I'll show you guys one day, if you guys want to see that, uh... But, yeah, it's like a tree house that leads to another tree house, leads to another tree house... You guys have probably seen it all before, but it was pretty cool. I like, I like have my apricot farm in my tree. Nether portal was up there. It, it was pretty, pretty cool. I liked it. Uh, one problem is these things do not spawn pro. I mean, drop like they got a really low drop rate, haven't they? Well, there's one. Yeah, these things got such a low drop rate. It's actually. It's actually shameful. I think it's because they're, they're really cool. A lot of people would like to use them for like building up tree houses and stuff like that. So there we go. Uh, let's go to see if there's any more. Nope. <coughs> Unfortunately not. Uh, well, I, I think I did something last time I did this to try and increase the chances. I think. Oh yeah, I was breaking the leaves with a fortune free axe, I think, or something like that. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. There is a lot of stuff here. I was looking around. That looks like an actual temple. Yeah, there looks to be a temple over there. Oh, that was a weird coloured tree. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna wait for these to these. I'm just gonna, well, I'm gonna break them. I don't need. We got one, didn't we? We get two. I'll be happy. Yep, two. We should be able to replicate a few trees from that. And they don't. They they, they if I think they have got a positive drop rate, so they always drop one. But I'm not 100. percent Look at this. What is that? I'm not even joking right now. What the? Oh, it's a jungle Poke Center. I've seen these before, but I like. It did not register. I just thought it was a uh, jungle temple. What's it doing up in the trees? So random. This is why I love this game. I mean, seriously, just the randomness that things come out with. Alright, here we go. Alright, let's go up here. What are you doing? Alright, uh... This way. And there we go. Oh, sugar. Sugar, did it, did it, did did Oh, honey, honey. Oh, look at that. That's pretty nice. There's a plane, sir. Oh, watermelon. Watermelon! Oh, I guess I'm just watermelon. Before I'd stop seeing it and then never see it again. Watermelon! Watermelon! Go get some of that watermelon. Mostly because... I can make this into food. Surprisingly, watermelon grows, like, when, when it's fully grown, it spawns quite fast. So, I mean, it only restores one hunger, but if you've got, like, four or five watermelon plants, you're, you're set for food. So, I think that's what we might be doing. I'm not sure what the saturation is like. It's probably terrible. But, what can we do? Hey, what can we do? This is pretty cool. Uh, this is, uh, this is the, jungle, the jungle one. If you guys haven't seen it, uh, some people might not say that, I don't know if they haven't played for a long and they're like, don't go into jungles normally but yeah, you got, you've got got two areas you've got the downstairs for your pokey swapping there's like all just chairs here then the upstairs is the normal pokey centre which I think this is really a cool place, I mean seriously 
it, it, it's really cool. I like I like these things. So maybe I'll make this my second home, or like my home away from home for later. Or maybe I'll make this into my first home, and then that first home will become my home away from home. I don't know. I always like to have like little points where I can go to homes that I can swap to. Uh oh, gotta be careful. These vans are gonna get me killed. I thought there's not a poke center down there, I think. Yeah, that is. Okay, so that. Just looking around, seeing if there's anything around worth going to. Uh, I suppose we'll go to that other poke center, then we'll probably finish the episode. Mostly because I think we'll be going now for at least 20 minutes, so. That was uh, shameful. It's not how you get down from a tree. You go down the wharf, or you don't jump out of the wharf, or you try to kill yourself, of course. Ah, oh, it's one of those thingy birds. You hear that venom gnat, just like, hello. <coughs> and what does the venom gnat evolve into, kids? <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. It's randomly in a coffin bit there. He evolves into a venom moth. And what does a venom moth evolve into, kids? I don't know myself, so you'll have to answer that one. Okay. That's good. That's my food uh, consumption. I'm glad I bought these mushrooms with me. It's just like mushroom stew all the way. All the way. See, this is what you normally see the dungeon. The dungeon? Uh, the uh, temples at. Like, like, they're normally on the floor. Freaking downfall, would you just go away? I don't want game mode, I don't want toggle downfall. There we go. Hey, look at that. Po I, can, I can actually put slash poke spawn. What the hell are these commands? I've never even bothered with any of these commands or looked. Time, set world, spawn, toggle downfall. I suppose there's one thing I could consider if I can't find my way home is to set the world spawn. No, I can't set the world spawn to here because then I'll die then come back here. Yeah. That looks cool, I want to capture that. Yeah, normally like this, normally in the ground, quite secretive. And you get your uh, downstairs and that. Nothing in there though, so. Nothing really worth. <gasps> Did we find one? We found a village! Big it up, big it up. Oh, and we found one of those treasure grove things over there. So we are, we are, at the moment, we're hype, 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 hype. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to end the episode here. And then what we're going to do next episode, we are going to go to that village. We're going to check it out. We're going to see what's in this treasure grove here. And we're probably going to do a bit more exploring till we before we go home. Because, I'll, or I'll find my way home, I'll find my coordinates to my house, and we'll work our way back from here. Uh, and we got to make some Pokeballs, but I think we need more Diamonds and XP, because I want to do a level 30 enchant on a hammer, or a diamond hammer, to try and get Unbreaking 3, uh, and stuff like that. Also, we need to set up a Nether Spawn, so... We can get tons of XP for the enchants, because I don't... I've done it before, but it's a pain in the ass. Or, just a random spawner, maybe. Just something to get XP. Or, if you guys know a way to grind XP really fast on Pixelmon, do tell. Do tell. But as the sun is rising, I end this episode of Pixelmon. So, if you guys did enjoy, please do like, and have a good day. So, until next time, guys, see you later, and goodbye.